Hi everybody, I'm Jessica Nickel from TTP Laser. In this video I will be showing you how to install RDWorks software into your computer and set the parameters to work with your machine. First you need to grab your included USB stick, put it into your computer, download all of the files into a folder that you can access easily. Once you have done this, you can take your included USB cable, plug it into the side of the laser machine into the port that says to computer, the other end into your computer, turn on your machine and we're ready to go. Alright, step one, open the folder you downloaded to your computer and double click on the file called RDWorks V8 Setup. It'll bring you to this pop-up which is asking to download this app to your computer. You click yes, which brings you to the setup wizard. You go ahead and click install. Here it's downloading the software files. It's going to bring us to the next pop-up. We're at the top. First you want to click install USB driver. This here is asking to connect and turn on your laser, which we're assuming you have already done, so you can just go ahead and click OK. The USB driver's install is finished, so you can click OK again. Then we're going to go to the bottom of this pop-up to click install. With the install now finished, you can click OK, and we can exit from the wizard. You can now go to your desktop. You will see a shortcut to RDWorks. Double click on that and again allow the app to open. Okay, with RDWorks now open, go down to setting on the lower right side just below device. Click on it. Double click device. Click on test. Confirm that your USB driver is installed and ready for use. If the test results are port test failure, you will need to go back and disable your antivirus and disable your firewall and start the installation process over from the beginning. Once you have confirmed port test success, click OK, click OK again, and then exit. Now that your software is installed, we will set up the parameters of your software to function with your particular TTP model. Please make sure that your laser is still connected and turned on. Alright, first we will go to File, Vendor Settings, we're going to type in your password, RD8888, click OK. Here we will click Read. After it is completed reading your laser, we're going to click Open and go to the directory of your laser installation files where we will double click on your RDV set. In this case, we are installing a Stingray file. If you have the Sunray, the file will be called 6090 RDV set. So after double clicking and seeing import parameter success, click OK and then click right. When this is completed, do not click the save button, simply exit. Now, on the top right of your screen, you have five tabs. Click on the user tab. If you can see the word read, then just ignore this next step. Depending on your computer screen aspect ratio, you might not see the word read, and you'll have to put your cursor over this border here until you get double arrows. Left click to pull down until you see the word read. Now again, we will click read. After it is read, click open. And now open the RDU file that corresponds to your model either the 1390 or the 6090 for the Sunray. Once import parameter success appears, click OK and click the right button. Lastly, we will go to the top left and click on Config, System Setting. Here you will change your homing position to the top right circle. You can now close this and your software and laser are ready to go. Thank you for watching this video. If you would like to see more tutorial videos, please click the like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel, TTP Laser Canada.